and then we can ask some questions um, of each other. My um, a friend came over right after the baby was born, was helping just uh, help you know watch West because West. His thing with the new with the new baby is that he wants to tear her face off. <laughs> His attitude seems to be, why would you do this to me? <laughs> this is the stupidest thing I have ever heard of. <laughs> it was all about me, and now it's not. Um, so, so uh, the friend had him on a stool because he likes to help make breakfast. He likes to crack the eggs, and so basically what that means is some of the eggs go in the bowl and. <laughs> Most of them go all over the floor, but he's participating, so he likes it. And and then it was time to scoot him over to rinse his hands off in the sink. And she said, "Hold on!" And he's on this high sort of stool, and the, he just fell over. And he fell onto his head, and um, and he started bleeding. And he, and he was, you know, he was bleeding, but you know, heads. So I said. Heads are notorious bleeders, you know? You can make a, a big stink about this. Just a little nick, and your head will start bleeding. And, uh, and I was very tired, and I had been working late, and I just wanted to go for a run, and I had this in my head, like, I just, I have this tiny window before I have to go back in the shoot. I'm just gonna go for a run. He's fine. <laughs> He's fine! Why, why are we making a big stink about this? And, and my wife was still is not able to, you know, get up and take him, for example, to the doctors. Um, I was like, I really think you should take him to the doctor. And I said, oh, I, really, really? A little bump on his head. Uh, you're just, by far, if you want to, I, I, I think I may have accused her of being passive aggressive. Um, as I was very passive aggressively, like, taking my running shorts off. Fine, I'll take him to the doctor. He doesn't need to go. It's a waste of everybody's time. And, um, mind you, at this point, my shirt, his shirt, and my wife's sweatshirt were all completely soaked in blood. <laughs> and I was in this sort of tired, delirious state where I was still telling him, it's fine, it's fine. He's a two-year-old who's bled at least his body weight out. It's not a big deal. And then we went into the doctor, and the doctor sort of started to peel back his hair, which was obviously mad in the blood, and uh, he was like, wow, look, he's going to need a lot of stitches. <laughs> it's not funny. So, and then I immediately started thinking, okay, well, maybe I could say that on the way to the clinic, he fell again. And this time really hurt himself because this, I, I was desperately trying to save face. But anyway, long story short, I've lost all credibility. Um, and feel like a really, really Six stitches. Oh, oh, but they're little. It's not a big one. Stitches. Oh, I'm bothering you. Yeah. Oh, okay. So, I'm sort of born myself. I'm a horror movie. Yes. All right.